to Blaze season officially over and 23 ABC Sports Director Stephen Hicks here now with how staff is closing up Sam Lynn for good. Stephen? Yeah, Sam Bakersfield residents have been threatened for years that they didn't build a new park, the team would move. Three weeks ago, that axe finally fell. And so while we've known this would be coming for some time, it didn't make that final game any easier. What do you say after 75 years? For me, it really hasn't even set in yet. Maybe try that famous line from Field of Dreams. The one constant through all the years has been baseball. And away we go. For all that time, Sam Lynn has been the home and the definition of unique. Hopefully, we can bring a couple of them to the game today. Take Jeff McDonald, the director of Stadium Ops, who has to climb on top of the roof of an ATV to hang a sign reading Game Today. It's just going to be sad when there's no more games today. No more games with the sun setting right in your eyes in center field. We have various hats. <laughs> That's true. It's the field where Hall of Famers got their start. Drysdale, Pedro, and Piazza. Now just memories for fans to tell the next generation. Fans like Mark Duffel. Good, man. The amateur photographer has been coming to games for years. So that's pretty cool. And wouldn't trade that minor league experience for anything. You make a real connection here. Look how close we are to these guys. Perhaps no one at the park has as deep a connection as Dennis Gallion. And these people like my family. You know him from that voice. Place in the program. 19 years, nice programs. he's been known to everyone as Froggy. <laughs> on the final regular season game, he got to throw out his first, first pitch. Ah, shoot, I can't do it. There are a few who could do what this front office did. It's the hardest thing I've ever done. Dan Bespris has been the voice of the team, the assistant general manager, and everything in between. Things were so bad when he started in 2011, his goal was laughable for professional sports. Get just 100 bodies through the gates to watch a game. Anything good that happens in this place? We did it. Nothing good happens out here unless somebody made it happen because that's Sam Lynn Ballpark. It's going to be teetering on the brink of disaster on a nightly basis, and our job is to keep that from happening and make it fun. No doubt the last few years were fun. <laughs> the on field entertainment in between innings is hard to beat. All right, guys, you want to come with me? But it's the outreach in the community that can't be replaced. Emily Hintz heads that, someone who moved from Nebraska for a shot to work in baseball. Even though it is my first year here, I've seen, you know, the community and, you know, people talk with many people. People have been out here for years and years and years, and it's just really sad to see that they'll no longer have this to come to. It hurts the fans. It's hard to see it go. It hurts this man even more. Come next April, I honestly don't know what I'm going to do. Tim Wheeler has been the team's official scorer each of the last 22 seasons. He's kept every score sheet during that time. Hey, we had a sun delay that day too. And had a streak of games that was only broken up by surgery to beat cancer not once, but twice. Tim says without question that the plays and the front office staff are what got him through those treatments. They were there, great support, and uh, you know, I'll never forget him for it. There was never going to be a happy end to this story. Never going to be that season to look forward to next year. But there was hope that the team could run off into the sunset with a Cal League title. Twice they staved off elimination. But winning it all just wasn't Sam Lynn's style. That is the ball game. That is the season. And that, my friends, is the Bakersfield Blaze. To steal again from Field of Dreams, if you build it, they will come. Yeah, win them all, I guess. Not this time. We'll have to wait and see if Bakersfield cares enough about baseball to make that happen. It's been awesome. So long, Bakersfield. But for now, it's safe to say that the sun has finally set on Sam Lynn. The clock finally struck 12, and here we are. You know, just happens. And the players are going to be fine moving on and up in the Mariners organization, but the staff won't be joining them. Six full-time employees are now out looking for jobs, while the rest of that game day crew looking for seasonal employment. In the studio, Stephen Hicks, 23 ABC Sports.